three up. I know you're very results oriented. I get that. Three down. It's a fail all around. Fail, fail, fail. On Felder and Mass on 98.5, the Sports Hub. All right, let's do it. Three up, three down with Greg Bedard, presented by Tullamore Dew Irish Whiskey. Enjoy the game with the original triple distilled, triple blended, and triple cast matured Tullamore Dew Irish Whiskey. Because when it's game time, it's Tully time. Please drink responsibly. Three studs, three does from Sunday's loss to the Commanders at Gillette. Who's your number one star for the Patriots, Greg? Uh, Christian Barmore. He's been on a heater. He was tremendous. This was his best game of the season. Uh, at least five total quarterback pressures. He's uh, He's been a beast inside. He's playing really, really well for this team. This was a weaselly move, but I went with uh, Tavai and Bentley combined. I thought the linebackers were okay. Tavai made a good play on the turnover, punched the ball out of there. I, Bentley, to me, is... He's not a huge playmaker, but he's a solid player. So I thought the two of them in tandem were pretty good in this game. Number two. Dietrich Wise, uh, very similar to Barmore. Uh, same number of, like, impact plays, quarterback pressures. Uh, they both played, um, you know, really well and won their matchups. Demario Douglas, again, I thought pretty good. Not great, pretty good. But generally speaking, when they threw him the ball, he caught it. One of them would have been a sensational catch. In the, I think there were only two targets to him that he didn't catch, and one of them was that, that near great catch. So overall, he's productive when they get him the ball. Number three, Michael Wenu. I uh, had him for just one knockdown. I thought he was tremendous in this game. Uh, it's amazing what he's done since moving over to right tackle and makes you wonder why they didn't do this a lot, lot sooner. Don't laugh. Juju. And until the last pass, I would agree with you. I mean, every time they threw to him, he caught it. Mm -hmm. And the wide receiver screen is not on him. It's on them. Mm -hmm. Like, what do you think he's going to do? Mm -hmm. But generally speaking, he was a contributor. It was the, the only ball he didn't catch all day was the last one. It was a big one. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I thought he was okay in this game. Do you have a thought there, Joe Murray? Yeah, I thought Nwainu was awesome. David Andrews uh, played very well this week. I, at least I thought he did, considering what's around him. And Jabril Peppers still makes an impact defensively, so those are my three ups. I guess I'm curious what his downs are. Downs, go. Number one, uh, Mac Jones. Uh, I had him for eight plus plays, 13 minus plays in this game. This is now outside of outside of the fourth quarter against the Bills. He's been playing losing football for five straight weeks. Jalen Rager. That guy sucks. Seriously, he sucks. He's so awful. He shouldn't even be in the freaking league. That the fact that they picked him up and Bill played him ahead of Booty is an embarrassment on the organization. R Rieger, he doesn't belong in the league. <laughs> Number two, Connor McDermott. I think he did, you this know, he be... did okay in this game, but seven total quarter quarterback pressures and almost getting your quarterback decapitated on that sack that was negated by, uh, oh, by that ridiculous roughing the passer penalty. Uh, just not good enough. Okay. Also wearing the wrong pants, correct? Uh, yes. <laughs> wearing the wrong pants. How does that happen? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Isn't that on the equipment, guys? Or You know what I mean? Don't don't we all just take that sort of as a symbol? Yes. It, it represents a little something. Better the wrong pants than no pants. Ah! <laughs> it's not exactly dialed in, you know, on every level. Number two, Maz, for you. Uh, I went with Tyquan Thornton. So on those two guys combined, Mac Jones went two for ten. I left Mac Jones off the list because I knew Bedard would have him up high. <laughs> Okay, but Thornton sucked in this game, too. How do you go two for ten thrown at receivers in this day and age? How does that happen? Good point. Third down there, Greg. Jalen Mills. Uh, three missed tackles, including on the, the third and 23. He didn't even play that much. Like he, He's one of those guys that I look at, and I'm just like, eh, I don't know how much he's invested in this anymore. I think there, there are starting to be some guys in that secondary and on this defense that are that are starting to get in that group. Adrian Phillips, for the same reason. Yep. He was on that play, too. Like, I'm sorry, that is that is the worst of the worst, that play. Third and 23, you let the quarterback scramble for 24 yards, and Phillips had him. He had him. And Sam Howell got away. Dude, time to retire if that's the case. <laughs> Joe Moore, you want to win? Yeah, Yeah, I think Mills was awful, but to give you three more, Mike is sicky. Uh, I thought it was bad, and for him to be the fifth receiver. Useless. He, he really is. Uh, and listen, he gave up on a couple of the balls there late in the game. That Again, that doesn't help Mac. Jack Jones, not interested yet. Whoever was that corner got beat by Sam Howell this week. I'll just give you one more. Mac Wilson, um, I, he played 15 snaps this week, but, like, come on. Don't go off sides on a non-punt punt block. Punt block. Like, that's pathetic. And I said this earlier to Greg, too many Macs on the team. <laughs> Both can go. <laughs> Meanwhile, the state of the offense is just one of the worst 
uh, in football. Uh, you know, they got – we talked yesterday about how badly they got outplayed and the time of possession thing. They lost, to, uh, again, like 37 to 23, basically. Vinny looked it up over the year, how they're being outpossessed this season. It's when Vinny throws it up, though, I'll give you the exact number. But it's – it's not even clou- it's not even close. They've outpossessed only one team all year, and that's the New York Jets. So, just another indication of how far it's fallen. How far it's fall. How far it's fallen. Easy for you, sir. Greg. Yeah, I know.